Hello, I'm Snappy Dragon. Welcome back to the Outer Worlds. So, here's the thing. Um, I am now level 30. I have uploaded a lot of videos on here. Um, but I'm going to try out the DLC because now I'm level 30. Um, so, Power on Gorgon recommended for players who have reached level 25 or higher. I'm now level 30. Uh, to begin the adventure of Gorgon, you must have completed these quests. Okay, so I need to actually do these fucking quests then. Fantastic. So I can't do it yet. What about this one? Murder on Uranus recommended uh, level 30 or higher. To begin the adventure, you need to... Okay. Okay. Uh, well, what we'll do then, we won't do that yet. Okay, so you need to, you need to, um, yeah, continue. So you need to, um, apparently, uh, go to the ship then. Okay. Right, so I did not know that. I thought you could just, as you're level 30, go straight to the DLC. Apparently you can't. Um, which is a pain in the dick. Seeing as I'll have issues with um, actually getting, because I don't know how you actually get to uh, when you do uh, Monarch free uh, free radio. I don't know how you get there. Yeah, look, how am I going to get there? Uh, I don't know how we're going to do this. Oh, fuck me. Forks windows order now. Adds beauty and verilimism multitude frontier. I don't know how you pronounce that word. Space is choice. So they add <laughs> what <laughs> double glazed windows. <laughs> okay. Right. Is that really a thing? Oh fuck no! I I have no idea. Verifying Captain Nice D Scar. Okay. Cool. Okay. So we got to get over there. Okay. If we just go round. Um, so if you remember, we did this before. And I generally... Can we not go through this door then? Is it sealed? Yeah. Because that's broken. Um, okay. Hmm, okay. We'll just keep going then. Um, if we follow the yellow brick road, and then we, <laughs> we can just get, <laughs> just get there eventually. Um, but if we remember, I, I did actually... I think it's like a blow, blow rock or a, a roadblock, yeah. Yeah, there's just no way. Um, so you have to go all the way round. Ah, here we go. So, Casadadia, Fallbrook, Amber Heights, Stella Bay. Okay, well we want to go up more, don't we? But there's, there's no way of you getting... Yeah, because I, I, I managed to get all this stuff earlier. Um... And I just sort of stopped recording, and I was like, I need to figure out what I need to do. But it's so... It, I just want to do the DLC, because I've never done them before. Um, and that'll be just a nice... Sort of send-off for the game, I guess. <laughs> Bit of a lag there.
Yeah, but so, so if you go up here, there's no way around, really. Or is there? You have to go all the way around, but there's no indication of where, like, if you go on the map, um, you've got to go there. Wait, can I, can I just fast travel there? Yeah. That would be easier, wouldn't it? Wetsworth High Society, finest cigarette in Halcyon. Okay. Wentworth Cigarettes. <laughs> Not every challenge can be solved with a gun. They can be handled through negotiation or subsection <laughs> with a hammer. Creatures take extra damage from plasma attacks. Auto, uh, auto mechanicals take damage from. Okay. Do what you were about. Okay, so. Oh God, I don't. I genuinely have no idea um, how to get there at all. There's no. It, it just shows you there um, the broker, right? But how do you. How do you get there? Obviously, you've got to find out how. It's so, it's so. For me, this is really difficult to do for some reason. It's not like a cave or something I have to go in or something or some shit or whatever. Or because we go through here, we went through here like ages ago, didn't we? Because um, now we're telling we we actually have to go through here. And I was like, you must have to, because obviously, you know, what's the point of it being there? So you go round, um, and it just sort of leads sort of down here. Can, can you climb in this game? Is that an option? Can you do that? There must be like a cave or something to surely, because that would make so much sense. If you go for a cave, then you could just end up there, wouldn't you? Yeah, look, there's there's no way you can even try and attempt to jump that. You just die, and then it takes about a year and a half to load it. Um. I don't have any idea where to go. So I looked online and apparently it is actually in a cave. But I don't know how to get there. It doesn't specify where the cave is, how to get to the cave. Um, and then it just sort of takes you to... Um, Devil's Peak and you just go through the cave. Or you just climb the mountain, which I've been trying to do and that's ridiculous. So apparently that's what you have to do. You have to find a cave, uh, which is probably the easiest, apparently, which is difficult because I can't even fucking find where it is. It show, it's meant to be on the map near. So if you, that's that's where you got to go, that's where you have to go. Um, and so it's apparently around this area here, and you can't actually. Can you? No, you can't place any. Um, Marcus down. So that's a pain in the dick. Um, so we've just got to guess where the fuck it is. So I'll be back in a minute. Oh. Hello. Well now, here I thought those mantisaurs had peacefully exited the premises. But you're a simpler explanation. Thanks for the assistance. No Name worries. Is Weston. Every once in a while, I set up a shop along these here roads. You find yourself in need of resupply, you come on by. Care to purchase a thing or two? Yeah, why not? Uh, I want some food, really, and ammo. Right, that would do. Uh, right, I need to figure out where I need to go now. Oh, this is new. Oh, God! 
Jesus fucking Christ. I think that's all of them. Well, they'd say it's all of them, wouldn't they? Yeah, this is our new area for me. Ah, here we go. Guys, okay, so I need to... Oh, God, I need a fucking code then. Okay, uh, fair enough. you got to get up there. Okay. Oh, God. I think I've actually got there. That was a pain in the ass. Just gotta get rid of these fucking things first. Are you gonna attack me or? <laughs> it's like just standing there. Oh, bombs! Yeah, forget about them. Ow. Oh god, okay. Good got the uh, stairs here. Dead. Give me your shit. Right, we are here. Fucking hell. It only took me about five episodes, <laughs> pretty much, I think, from the beginning. Um, we went to Monarch by mistake, and we now got here. I, I, I thought, ah, oh, it's not too bad. I thought I'd have a challenge or whatever didn't realise that it was fucking mad, wasn't it? Um, and now we've got better weapons, better armour, uh, it kind of helps, so, yeah. Touched in the head. What in the galaxy are you doing sniffing around my station? Unless you are, in fact, trying to suicide by Marauder? I'm looking for, me, uh, I'm looking for an information broker. Nice and coherent, good. Take it you're not with the Marauder then. By the hand of fate and my own cunning skill, I run this station. The Marauders may have other plans, and since my hired hands have clearly turned idle, it appears I have need of you. As my newest contractor, you may call me the Broker. Okay. Why me? You're here, and you're armed, aren't you? The feed's gone grainy, but it looks like you're packing deadly force. I barricaded the broadcast center, but I can only hold out for so long. Clear the Marauders out, and I'll pay you double the going rate. They destroy the transmission equipment, and I'll be out of business. The elevator and doors to the second floor are back online. Hurry before I have to lock them down again. How many Marauders broke into the station? Too many, considering I hired a bunch of no-good mercs to keep them out in the first place. Already, they've caused considerable damage to the station's property. If they take down the broadcast equipment, I'll be out of a job, permanently. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Okay, right. The walls painted in blood, but seeing as it's not mine, I'd say this calls for a celebration. This ought to square our debt. One hefty payment for a highly valued service rendered. But I admit, I do wonder why you ventured here at all. Allow me to pose my question in another manner. Why, in the nebula, are you here? I told you, I'm looking for a certain information broker. Ah yes, our little chat on the intercom. You're looking for the premier <coughs> broker for all oh, of Oh my ears, fucking killing me. me. Clearly. Phineas must have sent you. 
He's the only one insane enough to send someone to Monarch to rush me. I knew it was only a matter of time before he came a-knocking. Look, I might be late, but I fulfill my contracts, always. Are you mm. fibbing? Be honest. Have you seen Doc Wells? The guy's ancient. You take any more time, he's liable to croak. I take offense to that. Look, okay. Just, it might take me a while this time. Um, why is that? I am awaiting but a single <coughs> incoming transmission containing the information we desire. But MSI and the Iconoclasts are clogging the airwaves from Stellar Bay and Amber Heights. In their war against each other, they're scrambling each other's outgoing transmissions. Uh, so we kick them off. Exactly what I was thinking. They hurt us all with their pettiness. Which, of course, has inadvertently affected the incoming port and my livelihood. Um, okay. Can't we cut them off inside the station? No, they're jamming the limited frequencies we have at our disposal. Nothing extra planetary can get in or out until the frequency pollution thins out. The safest bet is to convince Graham and Sanjar to stop transmitting on their end. Okay. I'll talk censored to them. You do that, I'll be here waiting on the receiving end. Luck be with you. I have a feeling you'll be needing a pinch of it, plus a vat of patience. Okay. Be a doll and shoot any marauders you spot on the way down. A stranger comes to our home. If you're looking for a path to walk, you've found one. If you're looking for a teacher, I am one. Welcome to the Iconoclasts. Mm, okay. Uh, I just need to stop using the, uh, yeah. Stop? No. Spreading the truth is the only way to combat the board's poisonous campaign of propaganda against their people. Your broadcast sounds are working, nobody is listening. I realize the board has blockaded our efforts, but... Devil's Peak is an interplanetary radio tower. Surely somebody is listening. Surely? No one. I've been around the colony and I've never heard it. Uh, excuse me, I'm from Edgewater on Terra 2. If you'll pardon my saying, nobody I know has ever heard of you. All the more reason to double down on our efforts. Graham, we should be focusing on survival anyway. Food, ammo, and medicine. Maybe now is the time to pivot. Pivot, huh? If radio isn't working, we might try another way. It seems the captain's timing is more than just serendipitous. It must be fate. Serendipitous. I've had my sights on an old printing press for some time. The board uses magazines and advertisements to subtly focus the colony's attention. We will use their tricks against them. Wait, that's not what I meant. Help me clear out and repair the press, and I will have no need for that rust bucket of a radio tower. <laughs> Attack. There's too much work. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. I have time for this shit. I do not have time for this shit. I have time for any of this shit. Fucked up Roseway, I can fuck up this place. <laughs> right, we're done. Okay, sorted. I've had enough of your shit. Celia, didn't I tell you our new statistics based advertising model would be a hit? That you did, sir. How can yield improvements of 26.7% not quicken the pulse? How can 32% cost savings not moisten the loins? You've often posed these very questions. Clear my schedule. This newcomer has a meeting with me. Yes, I do. That's very generous of you. 
Uh, yes. That's very generous. Celia, you. will you make a note of that for my self review? Very generous. No, if you ask me to do another but side quest, so you're dead. I, can't I just want to complete this mission so yeah. I can do the DLC. <laughs> Rizzo's perhaps, or Auntie Cleo herself. I need to shut off your broadcasts. You, oh. I suppose that means you aren't here for the Saltuna. No. I'm afraid not. Oh, a shame. I'd been saving a bottle of iceberg aged whiskey for an occasion like this. Seems like you're having a rough time, Mr. Sanjar. Are you doing quite all right? Oh, don't worry on my account. This is merely the latest in a long line of professional erotic and athletic disappointments. I had hoped that livening up our advertisements with enticing figures would draw the other corporations back to our bosom, but it seems we're back to the drawing board. Tell me another time. Oh, I need I to... Look. Anyway. Okay, look. Um... I might grow in a landing pad. I see. And was his delivery of the MSI authorized greeting up to snuff? He did a bang up job. Well, that's excellent. I'll see that your feedback makes it into his review. What else can I do for you? Shut off the fucking radio. <laughs> The MSI to stop broadcasting, you're jamming Devil's Peak Station. You're just as rigid as the old executive committee. Why, we've hardly been able to get a clear message out until recently. When Graham finally shut up. It isn't easy keeping a town like Stellar Bay afloat, especially without the board's backing. We need that frequency to reach our trading partners. There must be another way to do your business. Well... Mr. Nandi here has a rather ingenious plan to get MSI restored to the board. On our terms, mind you. Are you out of your mind? You can't just go crawling back to your old masters. Well, we can't continue to subsist like this either. And if our advertising scheme hasn't borne fruit, then perhaps it's time we took matters into our own hands. Yeah, enough of this. What's the plan? It's a two-pronged approach. The first part involves seeing Stellar Bay properly defended. Uh, I seem to have a bit of a Raptodon problem. And a Mantisaur problem. And a Marauder problem. Many, many problems. But they can all be solved with a Bolt 52 cartridge. If you can get us what we need to rejoin the board, starting with the Bolt 52, we won't need to advertise anymore. I don't want to. I altogether. just want to finish this and mission. I don't board. like these side quests. Uh, look, you know what? Fine. In the old arms building, and what I do of is I kill you. <laughs> but I just, I'm being a complete. Su in. I said these at the beginning of the series. At the beginning of the series, you can be a, a, a hero, a villain, or a downright psychopath. You know what? So taciturn, so I dour. think it's time to be a psychopath. I'll be with bated breath. Oh, and while you're at it, there should be a terminal in the arms building with some dangerous information. Perhaps you could delete it so it doesn't fall into the wrong hands. I don't have time for your shit, okay? I have time for your shit. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> You're dead as well. Kill everyone, fuck it. Let's just do it, shall we? Right, dead. Fuck off. Okay? I don't care. I just want to get this done and out the fucking way. <laughs> fucking hilarious. Is that a riddle? Because the answer is yes. Hit me with another one. Oh god. I I just <laughs> I just fucking murdered everyone. 
Oh god, that's fucking brilliant. Oh, that's so fucking hilarious. It's the blessed sound of radio silence, which leads me to believe you have sweet, sweet news for me. <laughs> MSI and I can no longer are no longer transmit to. Is the data ready? Yes, indeed. I am back in business. But before we get down to it, might I ask how you handled the problem? In the end, I killed them. We did what we could, as best we could. Should probably leave it at that. Hmm, is that so? Does it really matter? Yeah, I moved them from the equation, yeah. How excessive! Though I imagine effective. Well then, let us finish the deal before you deem me superfluous too. I don't doubt that you are working with Phineas, but my contract specifies I relay any acquired information to the purchaser, and to the purchaser alone. However, to send the data, I will need your assistance in cycling the antenna's receiver so I can input the needed adjustments. Phineas doesn't trust many people. How do you hook, them up? How do you hook up with them? You make it sound so scandalous. Phineas has been in hiding for the past 35 years. He got in touch with Nioka first, who I use as a physical go-between. The rest is history. Okay. Fine, tell me how to fix it. It's simple, truly. I merely need you to waltz outside and throw the lever to cycle the power. I'll key in the numerical adjustments from in here. Got it. Terrific. I'll be here. Waiting with bated breath. Give a shout if the panel electrocutes you. <laughs> Right, um, I'm actually gonna leave. Um, I'm gonna leave this one here. See you in the next one. Take care. Peace. Hello, I'm Snapper Jack, and welcome back to the Outer Worlds. So, uh, the last one, uh, we ended up um, pretty much mass murdering everyone. <laughs> pretty much. Um, <coughs> Uh, excuse me. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, yeah, I, I, I just, I just wanted to complete a mission. To be honest, it's just running back and forth. It's, it kind of annoys me a little bit. Um, like Dead Island, for example. Um, towards the end of the game, I still need to upload that. Fucking hell, I'm being lazy with that game at the moment. I finished it. I just need to upload the rest of them. Anyway, it's really it's the end. It's just back and forth to the city, to the resort, to the jungle. It's, it's just back and forth every five seconds. Uh, so with this, I just didn't want to go back and forth every five seconds. I just wanted to get it done and out of the way. Um, that that's pretty much it. I just I just couldn't be asked. But and besides, not only that, you can technically be. A, so, uh, a psychopath in this game. I, spe I specifically said when I first made my first video on this that you can either be a hero, a villain, or just a damn right psycho and just shoot everyone that moves. Obviously, you can't complete certain quests if you do that. Uh, I don't know if it affects the story. I don't know. But um, I only can. I So, with Roseway, um, I accidentally click the wrong option and he just went mental and started shooting me so I thought well, I'm gonna defend myself then and uh, that that was that was it <laughs> I just ended up murdering everyone on Roseway one, two, check, check. sweet stars but that is a beautiful sound can you hear me we are a go for broadcast oh and I also dispatched Phineas here Impatient prick. Worse, I'm now indebted to him for it. Now I'll kindly thank you to get out of my tower. <laughs> Happily, I won't bother you again. Look, I am well aware that at times I may have the tiniest iota of a prickly exterior. But I must admit, I have grown rather fond of you. Take care out there. Go now, I don't... Boss, you seen this? Fuck. 
That's the first. Black hole. Did you see that? Yes. Whose ship was that? Looks like a UDL ship. Based on the gunnery attachments, I guess it's one of the board's blockade enforcers, but don't cite me on that. Oh well, a pity for the crew, but I can't see how it affects me. Speak for yourself, so I'm gonna check it out. Listen, I don't care a single whit what you do, so long as you leave me out of it. Murta, take care. Bye. Bye. Endless conversation. Jump start to the tower. What are we playing? Fucking. Speak to Phineas. Oh, it's Phineas, is it? Hmm. 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 Right, let's. Oh, that vibrated my ear. My ear, was... my ear is still fucked. I've got a really bad, like, um. It's, like, really muffled. I thought oh, I was just due okay, to the fact that I. I put like water in it or something when I had a bath. No, it's actually like a genuine like ear what infection. And it really uh, fucking hurts. You're gonna have to go with a Earache is the worst pain uh, a human serious. can ever fuck. Anyway, Did I kill them? Hey, I was close. You know what, I have been mass murdering a lot of people recently. No, um earache is, is like the worst pain a human can ever fucking have, I swear. Two fake earache, it all fucking kills. <clears throat> right, so. Uh, 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 <laughs> oh, Phineas. Phineas Wells. Where are you, my pumpkin? Do we kill him? Is that, what, is that the aim of the game? Is... Gimme that shit now. Oh, hold on. One hundred eight. Nah, he ain't enough. He ain't enough. Giddy beady. Right. Well, the thing is, here's the thing. So, at the beginning of the game, uh, Phineas Wells actually helps you, and he falls you out, and then you become um, Captain Harthorn. So, I don't know if he is a good scientist or just a crazy kooky one. Uh, I generally do not know, and I think I'm just going the wrong fucking way, completely. So, yeah. <laughs> Okay, no, maybe I'm not. Am I? I don't know. Let's have a look. Oh, no, maybe not. I am, yeah, I'm, I'm going the wrong fucking way. How do I get down there? Oh, it's fizzy, fizzles. Monarch Stellar Industries, Blusters dies with a whimper. Airways cleared. Okay. I do like the little fan art they do in the in the the Halcyon Observer, so it's a, it's a newspaper. I like I like their their artwork in the game, it's pretty pretty good. Right, so we gotta go find this this I, I fast travelled because I thought well if I go across these rocks I'm just gonna die. So I thought I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna go through here and see if I can get through that that way. Right, let's go. trying to fight these before and I just died instantly because of the acid remember that now I've got a light machine gun and I'm killing fucking everything see this this is what I mean I, I, 
how am I going to get across there? I, it took me so long in the last one to do all this crap. Oh, fuck's sake. Death comes to the descenders. Oh, deserters. Okay. Just deserters for the souls of discord. No escape from the land of the damned. I really do like these. Volume 68, issue number 5, 2 bits. So they're like, um... They're kind of like, um... Newspaper articles. That's what it seems like. They're pretty cool. Cool, cool, cool. Fucking hell. Look at this. Fast travel location, gunship crash site. You go on ahead. I'll just wait out here. Corporate technician. Yep. We'll be keeping watch here. Nice terminal. View logs. Error, unable to access. Okay. CEO is saying something about spare regulator bypass something, something. Something, something dark side. Something, something complete. Uh, I'm. <laughs> sorry. Uh, I'm turning this t uh, toward Groundbreaker. Oh, wow, okay. Uh, so. Oh, uh, jet. Okay. What now? Hello, my name is Jen. I'm the chief engineer on this gunship, and I'd like to let the record show that our captain is a total fucking hullhead. <laughs> I didn't know there was sorry in this game. So without fixing our regulators, spinning up the engines are going to blow through our coils, and we'll go flying off in a completely random direction. Well, here we are, thinking we'll hit soil in. This is your chief engineer signing off for what is probably the last time. It's a shame you can't see this metal finger I'm holding up, because I'm doing it as hard as I can. Okay. Pick up care tankerous canid talking module targeting module. Okay. Tell Phineas about the crash crash ship. Okay. Oh, so this is this isn't actually his then, I guess. I don't, to be honest, I don't actually know. I'll take all your ammo though. So where? So speak to Phineas. Where the fuck is he? <laughs> Okay, so um, I guess we have to go back to the ship then. Uh, let's do that then, I guess. Um, what, that, what, that, what is that? Does it actually say... I don't, I don't, it doesn't really fucking say what... Landing pad, there we go. Wait, is that the one that we want to go on, though? Yeah, I think that is, yeah. Don't know why I had an issue doing that. What, what are these other ones? Oh, okay, they're all the crossroads stuff, okay. Yeah, we go there. Um, why can't we go there, then? Why can't we fast travel? Is there an issue? What's the problem? 
fast travel to that, but not this. Ah, oh, there we go. Why wouldn't it let me fast travel then? That was a bit weird. So it looks like we've only got two planets left because we can go there. We can go. We've been to Aradanus. We're on Monarch now. Olympus and Tartarus. Um, we've been there. Terra Two um, is where uh, Edgewater is, I think. So yeah, I think we've only got what, like, two planets left. I don't, I don't think that's the end of the game. I don't, I don't think doing this, you've got to explore those planets first. Clearly, I don't think it's that easy. We've arrived at Phineas's orbital lab. Uh, oh, excuse me, fuck it out. All right, let's go. Stay safe out there. Why is my Alexa being funny? Alexa, what's the problem? Sorry, I don't know that one. Well, you're having issues. Why are you talking to me? <laughs> okay. Alexa, are you okay? I'm feeling very businesslike. Why not ask me for some business buzzwords? I don't want to. You started talking to me, and then you just started going green and blue all in one go. I don't know the problem was there. Right, okay. Da 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 Let's have a look around first. What the fuck are these? You can talk to them. They're pigs. Huge bubbly pigs. A Christa pig. Christy pig. Ugh. What's he been? You alright? You alright, little man? Okay. Let's. Should we just. What the fuck is all this now? Bubbles. His name is Bubbles. Hello. You alright, you big fat prick? Yeah. A little bit of, yeah, a little cuddle. You big fat prick. Yeah. Okay, let's stop fucking around. Let's start talking. To him. Right, hello. You, I'd clap you on the shoulder if I went behind a wall of bulletproof glass. I don't know how you did it, but Hiram Blythe just sent me everything I needed. According to Hiram's message, Minister Clark has ordered a suspicious amount of dimethyl sulfoxide. It's almost as if he's hoarding the colony's remaining supply. I'd rather not see all of Halcyon descend into chaos like Monarch. Once I have those chemicals, I can start reviving some intelligent, sane people to help me save this colony. So, good news. You're going to Byzantium and stealing those chemicals. Exciting! Okay, what's so important about these chemicals? If I had time and several blackboards, I could explain the details to you, but to put it briefly, dimethyl sulfoxide is the reason you're alive today. The chemical is absolutely essential to reviving the Hope's colonists. I need you to steal as much as you possibly can. The more, the better. If you don't bring me enough chemicals, I might not be able to save the Hope's colonists. And then nothing will stop the board from destroying this colony. Okay, what's so important about Minister Clark? Aloysius Clark, Minister of Earth. Virtually every colony requires the presence of a Minister of Earth. Clark is complicit in every one of the board's crimes. Whenever the board issues some new decree, you'll find Clark's signature on the dotted line. Okay, just tell me what to do. Ah, yes, the details. I'm not about to ask you to rampage through Byzantium trading bullets with the board's agents. We'll have to resort to subterfuge. Carmen Imagawa, she's my contact in Byzantium. Meet her at the docks. She'll have all the necessary intelligence you require. I'm giving you my old nav key to Byzantium. You'll need it to land in the Golden City. Remember, you're looking for dimethyl sulfoxide. Big green bubbling vessel with a warning label. I'll take as much as you can find. <laughs> okay. Whoa! 
warning label? Yeah, what the fuck? There's something about being discontinued due to severe adverse reactions. It's fine. You'll be stealing the chemicals, not ingesting them. Well, I'm not going to ingest them, no. Right, okay. Uh, fine, Carmen. Blah, 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 blah. Still chemicals. Got it. Okay. Right. Okay. Let's uh, leave him to his uh, big ass pig and his weird ass chemicals that I've got to get. And then uh, we'll we carry on then, I guess. We can now also do uh, one of the DLCs as well. If I do this, I probably might start it uh, somewhere. Um, but I don't know when. I, I, I'm just interested to see what it's like. Greetings from the Halcyon Parcel Service. Delivery is guaranteed within standard margins of certainty. I've got a special delivery for Alex Hawthorne of The Unreliable. Uh, with your permission, I'll see it transferred to your ship. Uh, what is it? It's a parcel, sir. Uh, are you sure it's not a package? This is the Halcyon Parcel Service. We don't deal in packages. So it's a parcel. Just send it over then. With right? alacrity. Stand by, Captain Hawthorne. An HPS certified distribution technician has deposited the parcel into your cargo hold in accordance with hazardous waste disposal procedures. They did. A, yeah, what? Wait, hold on. Cargo hold in accordance to with hazardous waste disposal procedure. What? They did what? They yeah, what? Three complimentary spritzes of anti Cleo citrus squirt air freshener. That's the HPS touch for you, Captain Hawthorne. On behalf of HPS, I'd like to remind you that HPS is not responsible for any damage, defacement, or unseemliness to your parcel. Thank you for your patience. But if it's my parcel, remember, then HPS why should it be a problem? Future parcel related needs. It just says open the package. <laughs> sure thing. Whatever. What 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 the fuck of what the fuck is all this now? Use. Fuck is that? Hawthorne, I'm forgetting this. Something's happened to me. Got mixed up in some shady business on. Oh, it's the DLC. But I landed on something big, and now this job's an itch I can't stop scratching. There's a whole research compound left to the Sprats. I think I'm close to figuring out why. But something dangerous is closer to me. Got the job through one mini Ambrose. Top runger who just came into some money was offering a hefty bit card for qualified help. Trust me, her money's good. <coughs> the mini. Take the job. If I ain't gonna live to see the payday, might as well be you. Consider us even, old pal. I don't mean to sound prim, Captain, but there's got to be a better way to ask someone to do you a favor. I just want to say, we got to take this job. This is the closest I ever been to starring in a serial drama. Only thing we're missing is a couple cameras and a soundtrack. At least this won't be boring. Ada, what the hell is going on? Lucky Montoya owed Captain Hawthorne a considerable debt. I believe this is what humans refer to as payback. Captain, the message contains landing coordinates for a small asteroid in the Charybdis cluster. It was recently registered to a Wilhelmina Andros. Then that's our next stop. Yeah, let's do it. Danger, mystery, severed arms. Count me in. Oh, Captain, we're in a proper mystery now. So, we're taking the job? Yes! I'll go pack my things. You think this is a toss ball stick kind of job or more of a heavy machine gun situation? Probably a heavy machine gun. Statistically significant tendency to encounter situations of extreme danger. Well, yeah. I doubt this guy lost his arm filling out paperwork. He was also the fourth best paid freelancer in the system. <laughs> the fourth best paid? <laughs> that sounds promising. 
Yeah, let's do it. Let's just do it. Oh, that's right. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay, I'm going to leave this one here because then I'm going to start my actual proper... Um, the DLC here. Okay, right. I'll see you in the next one. Take care and peace.